Just met. Nice to meet Good you. Just met. New father. A new father. Congratulations. Thank you. I have so four-year-old twins. Oh, oh my beautiful. gosh. Yeah, yeah. Girls are boys. Girl and a boy. Oh, that's so perfect. They're great. They're yeah. beautiful. Yeah. Oh, the. They both will give you different kinds of hell. <laughs> Just so you know. But they'll all they'll also but they'll both all love give you me differently. Hell. But they'll all give yeah. you hell. But they'll both love you in different ways too. It's so I, I like you have a girl and a boy. That's nice. I do. That's Haven nice. and Hudson. <gasps> Haven and yeah. Hudson? What perfect names. Yeah, so I named her Haven because she's a little bit of heaven. Aw, you're cute. I know. And then people are like, why'd you name him Hudson? And I was like, the river? <laughs> So I named so I named my daughter River, and people were like, "What's the meaning?" I'm like, "Oh, um, we live on a river." Right. <laughs> it's like, and we were both looking out, and we we're you, like, "River's a cool name," and yeah. but it's kind of a rock star name. I, Hudson's cool. Well, it yeah. is cool, but I didn't put a lot of thought. Hudson into and Haven. Well, don't yeah. tell him that. Um, <laughs> <laughs> there's therapy in the future. <laughs> he didn't. He didn't care about my name. Um, I have to what? ask you about the ice thing. Had you ever done anything like that before? The no. ice bath. No, it was. I didn't know if so you played cold. sports, Graham, because I feel like in sports people do. <laughs> Look at your face. Oh yeah. my God. Yeah. Have you ever done that? Have you ever? I have one in my house. Not this brand, but we have a, a cold plunge. Give me your address. That, uh, you give me your address. Send me one send of these. To yes. Wait. Amazing. Yes. Yeah. Wait. They're supposed to be really good incredible. for you. They're incredible. They're All really the good for your health. Yeah. Did you, yeah. like I found, once I was in it, yeah. like I woke up like oh, that. Yeah. It was amazing. And of course you, you feel do. Like, um, <laughs> like you can't breathe. Right. And like all oh. of your insides are shriveling up. But other than that, it's great. Oh, yeah. you know what? Sign did, me up, Nick. Did, did that sounds feel, like a hell of a party. Did you feel really rejuvenated? I did. Yeah, I felt rejuvenated. And I, I do it probably once a week because it's really good for inflammation. It is. And wow. you know, yeah. maybe you know, nights that get away from you, you have one too many glasses of wine. What? It's, it's good for that. Yeah. 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 You're yeah. the one who sends people tequila. That's your problem. <laughs> um, it's good. Have you um, ever done it? I have, I have done it once as a, like, and, and for like a second, like when we were in high school, I jumped in one of the, like the players' ice baths. Right. I was like, no. <laughs> but then I watched this whole thing on how good that is for your body, your heart, like, yeah. uh, like uh, there's yeah. so many things that that's good for. Um, and I, I don't know, I'd never done it, but I've always wanted one, but then I thought, am I that LA tool that's like, I have an ice bath in my, I just Wait, called you a tool. I, <laughs> I didn't want to say it. But... Wow, wow. That's two, Kelly. Yeah. That's two, that's two. Yeah. fake. Colin Hanks. Um, well, congrats Thank on getting you. picked up. It's a 14, 14 season 14? 14 season. That's amazing. Yeah. It's hard to last that long with a show. That's amazing. Yeah. So why do you, th and by the way, I love that Cuban was in the corner while you were in that ice bath. Oh, just get in there. And I'm like, hey, real easy from the cheap seats. You're like not in the ice bath. Cuban's like that friend you have who never does anything. But, but gives always, you crap about yeah, it. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I do yeah. that. And then I'm like, do it. No. Yeah. yeah. I was like, by yeah. the way, I had to bring that up. So wait, so why do you think the show is so successful? People love it. I think because we are the mirror to America, I think anything is possible. When people come out on our show, I mean, we've been filming for 14 years yeah. and we're all busy and we're all doing other things, but when those doors open and somebody comes out, yeah. it's their opportunity to change their life. And as melodramatic as it sounds, America is about possibility. And when those people come out, I mean, you, Kelly, you see it in their eyes, like it completely, changes their lives, and I love that about the show. That's so cool. Yeah. And the fact that you get to be able to help people to accomplish that. And we that. help a lot of people, yeah. and we teach people how to start a business, because you know, how many people in America know somebody who started a business? Yeah. And not everybody can go to a fancy school, and everybody wants to start a business, because if you can control yourself and know how business works, you'll never be poor in life. Yeah, it's, I'm not good at that kind of thing. I'm like all passion oh. and creativity. Like it's so good that people like you exist. Um, so what's, what's the one pitch though that you've heard that you, still amazes you? The, my favorite pitch is something called uh, Tipsy Elves. Tipsy Elves, I'm in. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. Oh, they took my drink. Yeah. They took yeah. my drink. Well, that was I, rude. I didn't get it. <laughs> I didn't get a drink. I know, that's rude. Wait, but my show is so rude. Round. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, but they came out, and one guy was a lawyer, and one guy was a dentist, and they hated being a lawyer and dentist. Oh. They were a little bit older, and they decided one day, we're going to start a business. Had no experience, no background. They Googled, what's a good business to start? And they found... What? I, I'm, I'm not making this up. They found 
Christmas sweaters, yeah. right? Ugly Christmas sweaters. So they said, how do we stand out in the ugly Christmas sweater market? Inappropriate ugly Christmas sweaters. I'm in. Yeah. So they come out, yeah. all the sharks are out, and I'm like, why am I here? This is horrible. And then I find out they have $600,000 in sales. They sell them online, bring them in, and I'm like, I think I gave people them... people like me exist. <laughs> I think I gave them 200000 for 20 or 25%, and that was many seasons ago, and we'll do $100 million this year. What? Yeah. Yeah. There's a lot of people like you. There are a lot of me out there. <laughs> do you know what's happening in the world right now? They're all watching this going, why didn't I think yeah. of that? So like, I could have done that. That's amazing. Those are the best ideas. Oh my God, yeah. it's so rare. Well, Robert has teamed up with his most successful Shark Tank investment, Tipsy Elves, to bring you a little surprise. Tipsy Elves makes the world's most outrageous apparel, I love it, to make <laughs> your life more fun. And today, each of you are getting a $100 gift card to Tipsy Elves. 